It's all right now. You farting here? Yeah, totally, bro. Ripped it's, it. Sounds like farts. No, but right now we're gonna do a, like a video for you guys, just of scooter tricks, because I know some of most YouTube videos are pretty good, like uh, some scooter tricks and stuff. Like I always watch them. So I'm gonna do one for you guys, just some simple stuff, not too hard. But um, yep. <laughs> This is my big bully, Gunner. How old's Gunner? Um, I think he's like seven years old or something. We've had him for a long time, like since I was like, I don't know, like seven or something. So he shouldn't be too old, but he's What kind of dog is he? Um, I want to say German bull mastiff or Italian bull mastiff, something like that. He's a bull master. All right, guys. So we're gonna do a tramp video right now. So basically, this scooter is basically go to your local Walmart or whatever or sports good place, buy two tennis balls, cut two holes in them, put them on the fork, put some tape over it so the tennis ball doesn't fall off. Obviously, put tape up here because there's usually sharp points, so it'll cut the trampoline. Put tape there. Another tennis ball. We usually cut or just jam really hard and put the tape around it. And then usually buy some grip tape, line it up right here so your feet grip onto this. I mean, if if you guys want it more easy to bar spin, I cut my bars, but I have another scooter that doesn't have my bars cut for like actual tricks, but for scooters, like on a tramp scoot, just cut the bars and it's a lot easier to do the trick. But for my first trick is a tail whip. Basically on an actual scooter, you're gonna jump as hard as you can to flick. Like with your heel, just flick. So here. Which leg did you flick with? So like, just flick it kind of like that. Um, I'm a regular, so I flick both feet back. So you kind of just flick it like that. All right, now I'm gonna land it. It's pretty simple once you get the flow of it. But yeah, so that's just basically tail up. You just want to slide it back. And then we're going to do a bar spin. The bar spin right here with the bars, slide it around, grab it. For some people on a trampoline or a scooter, some just toss it, grab it in the air. But I feel like it's easier if you just do that and grab on. So I'm going to do a bar spin for you guys. So basically, just. Turn it around, and there it has. Next trick, we'll do a backflip. This is more like a harder trick. Basically, all you do is just try to bounce as high as you can. It's kind of like when you land, just come press and lean back as hard as you can, and just kind of go with the rotation. Never let go of the scooter. Even though this isn't like got foam or anything, it still could hit you in the head and really damage your head. But we'll do a backflip. You guys, just kind of like when you land, just kind of as far as you can back, spin it. That's pretty easy. The next one will be a finger whip. What you want to do is always, people tend to do finger whips like this, all the way out here and just hit it, you lose it. You want to keep it right under you, so it's like this, and you have leverage in the deck and you just throw it. So I'll do finger whip for you guys. Sort of like that. It's kind of like, like actually grabbing the deck and tossing it. You kind of want to get obviously a little leverage under here. Feel like, like in the air, just basically go like this, just flick it. And then when you catch it, most people like to catch it in the air, but sometimes if you're not as good, like able to get enough air and do it quick, you will catch it on the ground. But if you're good, you'll catch it like up here and then land. There's a, various ways that you can do it. Yeah, that's basically how you do them. Finger whip, and then the next one will be uh, Superman. On a Superman, have your feet on the deck or on a tramp. You can put them to the side for the grip to use. Jump, kind of grab the deck. But when you grab the deck, throw it under, so you don't have like loose arm and it goes like that. You want to grab it in the air and just throw. So I'm the Superman. So 
that's a Superman. Also, like I said, grab it and throw it down. And uh, to really catch that one, you land on it, one foot off, fine, like this. It's a tramp scooter in kind of various ways. You want to do it, whatever you feel comfortable with. For my next trick, a backflip, no hander. I know, like, even though backflips are easy, taking your hands sounds easy, but usually some people tend to tend to fall off and bars twist, land sideways, crash, you know, so try to when you do it. Like I said, backflip, but put your hand like this so you hold on tight. Well, see how I kind of lost it there? My bar's kind of turned, I grabbed it. But don't really panic when you miss it. Kind of take your time to grab it because if you panic, you'll miss and that and fall and crash. But try to not panic, kind of get the grip so you're all good. And then for the next one, a double tail up. Like I said, if the tail up, kind of just slide off. But for this one, just if your feet are next, just kind of throw it. You kind of use it with your arms. See how my motion is, like turning the bars up and down? That's how you kind of want to tail up. Double tail for you guys, like I said, try to keep it under you. Don't let it fly out. And then for our next trick, we'll just do like a simple 360. It's really hard on a trampoline, actually. You gotta like turn very hard. If you don't, you kind of 180. My brother can 360 on a trampoline better than me. I really need a 360. So we're gonna try to attempt to get the full motion of a 360. Like that at 360, I kind of stayed steady. Don't fall off the back turn. Let your feet go because you kind of tail up with it. Yeah, and when you do a 360, don't just kind of turn your body. Try to like, say a flare basically, you want to turn your head and grab your shoulder like that with your mouth. Try to grab your shirt or whatever feels comfortable with you. Try to turn your head as far as you can and just spins you. But I, my next trick is a flare. You just kind of, like I said, put your head into the corner and turn, and you'll flare. Hmm. Oh. It's that easy. <laughs> All right, let me flare. Hey, you guys, kind of put your head in your shoulder, kind of like you're sleeping. That's how you do a flare. All right, now it's time to take it to the pavement. So first, we're gonna do a tail whip flat. Pretty simple. Some people tend to catch it in the air. I catch it on the ground. Off big air jumps, I obviously catch it in the air. Kinda land safely. But now, the next one will be a double tail whip. But first, we're gonna do a 360 flat. Alright, now a double tail whip off the black ramp. 